The power supply on the 24-hour router may need to be replaced with a new model if it had a failure, or you plan to upgrade to the Z-axis brake and or the ATC. If you plan those two upgrades, then you only need the new power supply if your machine falls within the serial number brake of RA10001 and RA10084. You must first power off your machine completely before making any electrical connections. If you don't turn off the machine, there's a risk of electrocution or shock. Power off the machine by pushing the emergency stop button. From PathPilot, press the exit button. Turn the main disconnect switch to off. Remove the power plug from the wall outlet. Then follow the correct lockout tagout procedures. In the electrical cabinet, remove the wire trough covers and set aside. Identify the existing power supply. Depending on the serial number of your machine, your power supply could look like either of these models on screen. Remove the wires from the existing power supply with a small flat bladed screwdriver. Then pull them out of their slots. To release the power supply from the DIN rail, pull out the tab on either the top or bottom with a small flat bladed screwdriver. Then tilt it up and off the rail. If you are replacing the white power supply, you also have to remove the ground wire. To do this, on the ground terminal strip, identify the ground floor wire, then remove with a small flat bladed screwdriver. You can discard the ground wire. Both of the gray power supplies are isolated, so they will not have or need a ground wire. Make the power connections on the replacement power supply. Connect wire 118 to the L terminal on the new power supply, and then secure with the screwdriver. Connect wire 115 to the N terminal and secure. Connect wire 402 to one of the V minus terminals and secure. Connect wire 401 to one of the V plus terminals on the new power supply and then secure. With the DIN rail clip open, tilt the new power supply onto the rail and then secure the clip. Give the power supply a slight tug to see if it's secure. Then tuck the power supply wires into the wire troughs and reinstall the troughs. Your 24 hour should power on normally. If it doesn't, shut the 24 hour down again and check the wire connections. If that doesn't work, go to the support tab on the Tormach website and submit a support ticket. Thanks for watching.